So, we stopped the ritual. And Varric paid the price. Hey, Varric made his choice to go talk with Solas. He knew the risks. We all did. And now Solas is gone. And we're here. Wherever here is. Besides in the Fade. Solas called it the Lighthouse. He did? When? Sorry. It was while I was unconscious. Solus appeared in my dream. Really? I'm glad you're all right. From what I saw, he's trapped in the Fade now. Not here, but some kind of prison. You're sure that wasn't just a dream? It's a reasonable reaction. Solus can speak with people in their dreams. Even kill them. He said our connection wasn't strong enough for him to do that. He could only reach me because I bled at the ritual site when I got banged up. So Solus is using blood magic, like any normal mage would to play with your mind. But he's not a normal mage, like I told you. He's an elven god. Putting together a nice ritual doesn't make him a god. The gods of my people were incredibly powerful. I don't mean they were powerful like a skilled mage. I mean they destroyed entire cities. They shattered mountains. So no, they might not literally be gods, but they're a lot worse than whatever you're thinking. All right, well, we've stopped the ritual and there doesn't seem to be an immediate danger. For now. You're certain Solas can't use blood magic to affect your mind? I'm not certain of anything. But we're not out of danger. What do you mean? Solas had two of the other elven gods imprisoned. When he got trapped, they escaped. So those things we saw come out of the Fade when the ritual went wild, those are... Elgernon and Gilanane, two of the ancient elven gods that Solas rebelled against. They're free because of us. They're free because of Solus. Lace is right. If we hadn't stopped that ritual, countless people would be dead. I know, but still, they're out there now. Okay, then we find them and we stop them. Solus says Elgernon and Gilanane drew on the Blight for power and became corrupted. That was when he imprisoned them. So instead of one god running around, we have two. And they're not just powerful, they're blighted. We need to get out there and stop them. Just like that. We're down a man without Varric. We can't just rush in. I know you're hurt, Nev. But the rest of us need to do something. I'll be ready to fight when it's time, but we need to investigate, then figure out what we're dealing with. And how many more people will get hurt, get killed, while we spend time investigating? If Elgernon and Gilanane are worse than Solas, we can't go in blind. We need to know what they can do, and what they want. But we only have Solas' word about all of this. Then let's go investigate for ourselves. We'll find out what we're dealing with. And then, we take our shot. Fine. The Alluvian led us here instead of back to Minrathis. Let's hope it goes back to the ritual site. Maybe we can find some clues at the scene of the crime. Nev, are you okay to go? It's a headache. I've worked with worse. All right, then. Let's get back to the ritual site. The Alluvian has its own special room. It's just down the stairs. For all we know, there's a dozen demons waiting on the other side of that Alluvian. <clears throat> if it even takes us back to Arlefin. Nev, you sure you're up for this? Don't worry about me. Shall we? Let's do this. <laughs> <laughs> 